Help me help you. I saw some ugly color for the back of it. Oh, then we're gonna have to go for two pillows. Hmm. But she doesn't really use them anyway. Actually, I mean, it's blue. What do you reckon? It's kind of a lot of blue. Huh? It's kind of a lot of blue. It's a lot of blue, isn't it? Well, maybe you can use the tool. You really want cake? No, cake. no, they don't need cakes. These no, are. No, cake. I like this. That is. Nice. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, good thing I'm, Mum wasn't driving. <laughs> it would have been hilarious. Hi. Woo! Smell it. 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 Wrong door, wrong door. Jesus Christ, please. <laughs> I was too busy. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. Um, the other children are coming. Paul doesn't like seafood and Charlotte, um, is cooking, so. It smells so much in here. They look frozen. Look, oyster wheel. Are the tin foils? Uh, I'm not saying the oyster wheel. I like the octopus, hey? Huh? It's keeping out so much and then it should be. Do you have shuffled oysters? Like, or like pre shuffled oysters? Ah, oh, banana mum. On the 24th of January and I just woke up from a nap. 
So basically today what happened was we woke up, well actually we were all awake besides Corey and left, got ready around 2.30ish and then we were all ready to go until we figured out that Corey lost his wallet and we spent an hour searching it, so that was fun and we still haven't found it. So he had to cancel all his cards and whatnot, and then he's gonna have to pay for his license. And then I'm gonna be his taxi, which is gonna be amazing, isn't it? So we end up going, we end up leaving, and I, well, but like we drove all the way to Adelaide, and I was awake the whole time, so I was sleep defied, defied. I like I hadn't, I didn't sleep. So um, we end up going to my grandma's house, and then. I am not sure you can with it, like, you know, all the Asian, I'm like, I can smell the Asian. Like, it's just, like, all the Asians have, like, an Asian smell to their house. Um, comment down below if you know what I mean. Like, it's really weird, but it's true. And then, so, we, we got out, um, went to the toilet, and then we sat back in the car while my grandma was grabbing stuff. And she was in and out, in and out, in and out. And then she kept forgetting stuff, which was, you know, Typical because she's a grandma. Well, I'm not gonna say she's a grandma, but my excuse for it. And then we ended up going to Arndale's fitness like bakery, the bakery in Arndale's Plaza, because it opened at like 5:30. And then um, we like they ordered over 20 Vietnamese pork rolls, and then you know 10 cans of Coke. And like a bag of hot bread and then you know a tray of more bread I'm like Jesus what are we gonna do with all this bread and then we end up going back to my grandma's house because she ended up forgetting stuff and then once we were all set we end up heading off to fix uh not fix the harbour port Lincoln and then that's when I fell asleep it was the most uncomfortable sleep ever I was like against the pillow Charlotte's chair was digging into me her elbows were digging into my legs it was not fun whatsoever and then we ended up stopping in Port I guess uh, I'll we ended up shopping in a port area and then I was like why are there so many petrol stations? There was about six six petrol stations along one like road when you go out like when you go into out of town. I th like to me that's a lot because you know I didn't think it was like such a big town but I'm guessing it is. And then we ended up driving at Lincoln and we got pulled over for our um, alcohol breath test and then when they were done my grandma was like ask him about the best fishing places and Lisa and I just both cracked up laughing like oh my god mom so we ended up asking him and then he said um 21 k's down to some bay you get this and this and this at like, the type of fish and I was like that's good it's good so we were both cracking up laughing again and then we ended up after we left, that, left the police area we ended up looking for oysters and the first one was like 18 bucks per dozen and I'm like what so we ended up looking for more like and that was really crowded as well so we ended up looking for another one another place and it was six dollars a dozen like this was shackled oysters so we ended up getting that and then we ended up kind of finding the apartment settling in um basically and then you know we went shopping chilled i ended up just having a nap because i was exhausted and then i woke up no one's here besides Corey says so anyone else is at the fishing spot which is like a block away but no one has time to go walking at this time but i don't anyway but yes, that's basically what happened today. Um, and I came out here with the best natural lighting, which is just you no know, amazing um, road. Because at the front of me is the Tunarama Festival right there, but that gave me no lighting, so I'm like, oh. and that is about it. I will end the vlog. It wasn't really much of a vlog because we spent 10 hours in the car. Um, I did post a few random clips here and there. But I will end the vlog here. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. See you later guys.